The scale of the rights is moving into uncharted territory for France. According to the President Macron, the destruction that has taken place is already worse than the infamous 2005 French rights. Nearly 500 buildings have been burned down, 1000 plus people have been arrested, hundreds of police officers have been injured. Things have gotten so bad that the government has decided to deploy 45,000 police officers to try to get things under control. The riot started because of the news that two police officers shot and killed 17-year-old Algerian boy at a traffic stop after the teenager had broken some traffic law. Initially, the police officers claimed that they fired because the boy was driving straight towards the officers. But videos captured by bystanders show things differently. In reality, among two police officers, one of them, close to the window, said to the boy, you are going to get bullets straight in your head. This is when the driver starts taking off, then the officer leaning on the hood and pointing his weapon to the driver fired his weapon as the car was taking off, car goes on for a few hundred feet before crashing. It was later found that the driver Neil died shortly after due to the injuries from the gunshot. This incident is what gave rise to the rights. Many have compared these rights to 2005 when weeks-long rights broke out after the death of two young boys hiding from the police in an electricity substation. As a result, three consecutive nights of violence have rocked major French cities including Paris, Marseille, Lyon, Lille and buildings have been set ablaze Vehicles torched and stores looted. Looking at the crisis, French government deployed 45,000 police officers to restore order. President Macron condemned the killing of a young boy and expressed his sorrow to the family. Because of the current crisis, French President Macron left a European Union summit in Brussels to attend a second cabinet crisis meeting in two days. He had also appealed to social media platforms to remove videos, the sensitive videos, and identify individuals inciting violence. The riots have not been affecting streets only, but it is affecting other important businesses and entertainment activities in France too. Back to back, two concerts have been cancelled. UN emphasized the importance of peaceful assembly while the French authorities to ensure non-discriminatory use of force by the police. The reason is the killing of a teenager Algerian boy of rights, but the real reason is deeper, more deeper, that the rights to bring attention to broader raw of issues over police tactics in France. Though the prosecutor has already opened up an investigation for men's slaughter against the police officers, Many believe that the incident is rooted in deeper problems in French society. This was the third killing this year during a police traffic stop after a record 13 deaths last year. So the victims have all been only black or Arabs. Now the world is asking, is France racism problem rooted in denial and discrimination?